My name is Amana Liddell. I am a biology and psychology double major and I'm in the class of 2022. I can never remember a time where I didn't want to become a doctor. I really just enjoyed kind of the science and the health aspect of school and those were always kind of my favorite subjects. My biggest thing kind of that started it off is I wanted to be solving a puzzle every single day. It's just something that I've always felt like I was meant to do. I was lucky enough to get the opportunity to be a part of SCU EMS for the last year of my time at Santa Clara and I've gotten to really experience what SCU EMS is as a volunteer organization. This is just something that we all think is really important to offer to the student body of Santa Clara and something that has a lot of value for keeping our students safe. I think I took my first ethics course at Santa Clara my sophomore year, and it's still to this day one of my favorite classes that I took at Santa Clara. I took ethics and healthcare. Through that, I pursued my Hackworth Fellowship. The Hackworth Fellowship is a program for juniors and seniors at Santa Clara to dig deep into an ethical dilemma that they are passionate about. It's very open-ended, and people can choose what they want to produce from their fellowship and what they want to look into. For my Hackworth Fellowship, I spent a lot of time digging into journal articles and doing a lot of research about what was being said in the media, kind of about the disproportionate impacts that COVID-19 was having on a variety of marginalized communities. For me, writing a paper was the thing that I was used to, the thing that I was comfortable with, but at the same time, I didn't feel like a paper would reach the communities that I was wanting to reach, and I wanted to make sure that I was getting this information to the black community, because a big thing that has been an issue is mistrust in the medical community, and that's something that was exacerbated during COVID. And so I felt like an infographic was something appealing for people to want to grab and look at. I think that ethics will always be something of the utmost importance to me and kind of something that grounds me. Even for my future steps after graduation, I'll be applying to medical school and I was struggling really hard to figure out what my personal statement would be. But thinking back on what I have learned and kind of my why for medicine, I think ethics has played a huge part. I have a note on my phone that has always been um, added to of like, it's literally titled like the doctor that I want to be. For me, the doctor I want to be is one who is genuine and caring and makes sure that patients feel important. I think it's also important that patients feel like the questions that I'm asking about their lives aren't just to make small talk or make conversation, but that I have a genuine interest. And I think the biggest one for me is I want to leave people better than I found them. I'm definitely ready to graduate while it's something that it's definitely nerve wracking. It's this balance of both excitement and nerves, but I don't think nerves always have to be bad. I think there, it's more of a positive experience and like this is change and change is never easy, but it's different and I'm excited for kind of what has to come next and what will be coming up.